In this video, I'm going to make a modern planter box from pallets. And to get started, you're going to need a stash of pallets. I started by cutting all the pallets down to size on a miter saw. The size of this planter box is 16 inch by 20 inch long. Next, I'm going to cut down some 1x2s which will be used for the frame. And you can always use 2x4s or whatever size you want to use. I'm going to take a nail gun to nail the frame together. You can also use this screw to attach the two, but pre-drill the hole so you don't split the wood. Now you're going to need to make two of these, one for the top and one for the bottom. Now I'll attach a piece of wood in the corners and this piece will dictate how tall the planter box will be. Now at first you might think that this is probably not strong enough, but by the time you add all the pallets wrapping around the frame, it becomes really strong. Now I'll attach the pallet to the face of the frame and you're gonna offset every other board as shown in the video. It's almost as if they're interlocking and this would also help with the strength of the box as well. Now install the bottom. In my case, it's not gonna go all the way to the edge and that's because I'm using a flower pot that I'm gonna place inside the frame itself. I also drove a few screws through the planks on the bottom that goes inside the one by two. Next, I'm going to take a few pieces of pallets and I'm going to create a trim going around the interior of the planter box. Now this piece is mainly to hold up the rocks that I plan to put on top. Now it is pallets and the texture of this is really rough so I'm going to take my belt sander to clean it up a bit to accept paint. Now I applied one coat of paint first and after that dried I came back with the caulking and then I filled in the nail holes and also some of the cracks. And now to keep the box elevated off the ground I'm going to make some legs and it's pretty simple. Take some 2x4 and I'm going to cut 45 and then on the opposite end cut 45 again. Now I'm going to attach the legs with three screws, so two on the outside and then one from the inside of the box. Now sand the legs down and later I'll come back with a coat of clear polyurethane. And next up I'm going to use this plastic lid which will catch the drainage from the flower pot. Now insert the flower pot inside the planter box. Next I'm going to take some weed barrier to help support the rocks. 